What's up, everybody? Brian Reese here, the VA Claims Insider, coming at you live from Austin, Texas. Welcome to today's presentation where I show you guys what actual VA raiders want to tell you. All right, you're going to learn three secret VA claim hacks today. You're going to learn exactly what the VA doesn't want you to know. All right, so let's step through this thing. I know your time is really valuable. All right, so this is how you file for VA disability benefits, all right? And unfortunately, you end up stuck, frustrated, and underrated. All right, I get it, guys. This process sucks. It's hard. It's confusing. Stick with me. When you walk away from today's presentation, you're going to have a complete understanding of what you need to do to move yourself forward, okay? So sit back, relax, and pay attention, all right? So by the way, did you know this? Eight out of 10 veterans are underrated. Eight out of 10 of you hearing my voice right now are stuck, frustrated, and underrated, meaning you are missing out on benefits that you deserve under the law. This makes me sick, guys, and this is the reason why I founded VA Claims Insider, okay? Now, we got a lot to cover and not a whole lot of time, okay? But my promise is this. In the most actionable 30 minutes ever, I'm going to share all the three secret hacks. I break these things down step by step. Literally, guys, expert tips and tricks that guarantee a higher VA disability rating. I'm going to show you the one massive mistake made by most veterans and how to avoid it. And I have a special bonus for you at the very end of the training. Okay, so stick around to the end. Don't leave because I've got a free bonus for you at the end. Okay, all right. Please don't use these powers for evil. What I mean by that is the things that I'm sharing with you today are so powerful that they could be used to get something that you don't truly deserve, okay? So please don't do that. Don't ever file a false claim, okay? That's my brief disclaimer here. Please make sure that you're operating with full integrity and that everything you're doing is legal, moral, and ethical, okay? But I want you guys to avoid my $90,000 mistake. There's a lot on the line here, okay? What's my $90,000 mistake? My VSO screwed up my claim and I lost over $90,000 of tax-free compensation, but I didn't know any better until years later. Okay, again, that's why I founded VA Claims Insider, guys. Stop struggling on your own. Okay, why the heck would you listen to me? All right, here I am versus what I do. All right, I'm a dad first. I'm a lover of Jesus Christ. I'm a Christian. Uh, and I happen to be the founder and CEO a VA Claims Insider. Okay, I got about 15 years of corporate and military leadership experience. Uh, I'm a former active duty Air Force officer, United States Air Force. Uh, I was fortunate enough as well to play NCAA Division I hockey at the academy. All right, so I'm a U.S. Air Force Academy grad, and I've got an MBA from Oklahoma State. I'm now a 100% service-disabled veteran, and guys, this is what I do. When I wake up in the morning, I think about my fellow disabled veterans and how I can help you get the rating and compensation you deserve, all right? Enough about me, guys. We are here to talk about you, all right? Are you ready to go? All right, let's do this. All right, so a quick word of caution. Integrity, service, and excellence. You must operate with absolute integrity when filing or refiling a VA disability claim. Please do not ever lie or stretch the truth. It is against the law to file a false claim, okay? Now, three things. This is very important. Are you even eligible for VA disability benefits under the law? Okay, you've got to show three things. Number one, you have to have a medical diagnosis of a disability. That can be in service treatment records, in any VA records, or any private records. Okay, but if it's not in a medical record, guys, you're dead in the water. Okay, so get your butt to the doctor and get a medical diagnosis. Okay, the second thing there, though, is the disability in number one must have been caused or made worse by your active duty military service. That's what's referred to legally as the nexus. A nexus just means that there's a logical link between an in-service incident and today in that disability and that the VA raider can look at that and say, okay, cool, there's the nexus, there's the incident, there's the injury, okay? So if you've ever looked inside eBenefits and you see things that say not service connected, that's what that means. All right, it's very important. We're going to come back to that one. All right, but that's the second part. The third part, you must have persistent and reoccurring symptoms of the disability into the present day. Uh, and at VA Claims Insider, we call that severity of symptoms. But I just put here, how is your disability affecting or limiting your life? 
Okay, you need to explain that in clear English. All right, let's get to the three secrets, all right? These are from actual VA rating officials, guys. That's part of why we call ourselves VA Claims Insider. We get insider access to information that nobody else has. So here's the three secrets. Secret number one, fully developed claims and secondary claims. All right, how to beat the VA, take control of your claim, get an immediate ratings increase, and have it decided six months faster. Secret number two, DBQs and medical nexus letters. How to legally and ethically get 100% rating and over 3,000 a month tax-free for life, assuming it's deserved, right, by law. This one's easier than you might think, all right? Now, you might be going, what the heck is an FDC? What's a DBQ? What's a nexus letter? What do you mean by secondary claims? What do you mean by keywording and modeling, Brian, and number three, all right? We're going to cover all this, guys, so get ready, all right? Here we go. Secret number one, let's do this. Brian, what is a fully developed claim and a secondary claim? All right, guys, here's the deal. There are two reasons why VA disability claims get denied. Reason number one, there's not enough medical evidence. Reason number two, the VA rater, that's the individual who looks at all the evidence and tries to make a decision. If you have the condition and if it's service connected, they're unable to determine that nexus, right, which is the logical link to your service. But stay tuned. I have a solution for you. All right, so what I'm going to show you right now fixes those two things. All right, there's two types of claims, guys. When you go to file your VA disability claim, there's something called a standard claim, and there's something called a fully developed claim. The standard claim is what your VSO does, okay? It relies on the VA to track down crucial information. It takes longer for a decision. Your rating is less accurate, and you lose control, okay? All of this sucks. All right, the VA has something by law called the duty to assist. But guess what, guys? They fail in their duty to assist. If you don't provide them with everything they need up front in one shot, I can virtually guarantee you your claim is going to take way longer and you're going to end up underrated. Okay, so don't go with the standard claim. We recommend something called the fully developed claim. You can file this online yourself in about two minutes. All right, it's like TurboTax on either eBenefits or VA.gov. It relies on your medical information that you upload. Okay, as of right now, you're gonna get a rating decision 40% faster, all right? From submission, 90 to 120 days, you're gonna get a rating decision. Your rating is gonna be more accurate, meaning you're more likely to get the rating you deserve by law, and you keep control of the process, all right? Success, <laughs> all right, we like this. All right, now, when you go to file your fully developed claim, there's two types of disabilities, something called primary disabilities and something called secondary disabilities. Now, a primary disability is a main focus of VSOs and most vets. What you're telling the VA is that, hey, this condition was directly caused or made worse by my active duty service. All right, again, you have to prove the nexus, which is that link back to your service. An example here would be combat-related PTSD. All right, let's say that you're uh, an Iraq war veteran, okay? You fought in OIF, Operation Iraqi Freedom. You were uh, succumbed to IEDs. Maybe you witnessed KIAs and other casualties, and you came home with severe post-traumatic stress disorder from combat, okay? That would be considered a primary disability because it's directly due to your service. The problem here, guys, is if you've been out of the military for more than a year, it gets infinitely harder to prove the nexus, especially if you weren't diagnosed on active duty, okay? And let's be real, nobody goes to the doctor as much as they should, all right? Raise your hand if that's you, all right? I've got two hands in the air because that was me, okay? That was part of my problem. I didn't go to the doctor enough when I should have, but stay tuned. Again, we've got a solution. All right, secondary disabilities. These are the most overlooked, but the easiest to win. What you're telling the VA is that a, another disability, okay, a condition you're suffering from today was caused or made worse by another service-connected disability in your body rated at 0% or higher, okay? Now, the benefit here is it's easier to show the nexus. So an example here would be something called chronic pain syndrome, also known as somatic symptom disorder. If you suffer from chronic lower back pain or neck pain or knee pain, it's possible that that's affecting your life in very significant ways, all right? Perhaps you've become depressed, you suffer from severe insomnia, you've got 
anger issues, you've gained weight, you've got relationship problems, you're having the difficulties at work, memory problems, etc. you're eligible for a high value secondary claim filed to uh, current primary conditions like your knee, your back, your migraines, your GERD, your IBS, okay? So guys, don't limit yourself. We are experts in helping you with secondary disability claims. That's what we do, okay? Now, almost anything in the human body can be connected to something else, okay? We know medically that if your back goes, it's likely to affect your knees, all right? If you've got major knee problems, it might affect your feet and vice versa, okay? Did you guys know that obstructive sleep apnea is medically linked and related to post-traumatic stress disorder? Okay, an example here I'm gonna give you right now though is plantar fasciitis, which is severe heel pain. This is a personal example of mine of my left foot plantar fasciitis, severe heel pain caused by my right knee condition, okay? Now, here's the deal, here's the background. I was service connected at 10% for my right knee. Five years after leaving active duty service, I developed plantar fasciitis in my left heel. Okay, it's very severe heel pain. I was diagnosed, by the way, so I had a medical DX and I was seeking treatment. Now, do you think I would have been granted primary direct service connection if I would have filed this as a primary disability? No, no, absolutely not. And the reason I would have been denied is the VA would have said not service connected. We couldn't find any evidence in your active duty service treatment records of heel pain or plantar fasciitis. Well, of course there wasn't because I didn't go to the doctor. I didn't have plantar fasciitis while I was on active duty. So of course I wouldn't have gone to the doctor for it. It developed years later as a result of my right knee condition. Okay, now I want you to think about this. If you've got a right knee problem, it's very likely that you're going to start favoring the left side of your body because of your right knee problems. So what happened is I developed a calcified heel spur on my left heel. Okay, again, I had an x-ray. I wrote a statement in support of a claim on the VA form 214138 for my plantar fasciitis secondary to my right knee. I uploaded a medical research report on the prevalence of plantar fasciitis in military members. I had my medical records with the diagnosis. Boom, okay, here's the exact statement, by the way. Now take a look at how this is structured. I characterize the diagnosis. Left foot, severe unilateral plantar fasciitis. I have severe plantar fasciitis in my left foot. I believe the secondary to right knee strain. My body now favors my left leg due to my right knee problems, excessive wear, tear, overuse, and strain, okay? Nothing helps, all right? So it's talking about how it affects my life, okay? So a couple of things I want you to pay attention to of how this statement is structured. Number one, self-diagnosis. Number two, I explain the nexus myself of why I believe it's due to my service, okay, or to another service-connected disability in this case. And then in the third part, I talk about the symptoms. How bad are the symptoms and how are they affecting my life? This is how you should structure all of your personal statements, guys. All right, medical research hack. This is free, by the way, pubmed.gov. All right, it's a US government website. They publish medical research reports and papers. You can use it to search for things to help you prove service connection, either direct service connection, secondary, um, or any presumptive for things like Agent Orange exposure, um, Gulf War syndrome, and all of those types of things, okay? Boom, there's a free hack for you, all right? So this is what PubMed looks like. This is the actual report that I uploaded in support of my plantar fasciitis claim. I literally typed plantar fasciitis military into the search box, click search, look at number three. Plantar fasciitis and military members, a case report, it was medically linked and documented that of the general population, military members are more likely to suffer from severe ear pain than your everyday average civilian. Okay, I uploaded that in support of my claim. So what happened? I ended up 20% service connected for my left foot, plantar fasciitis, secondary my right knee. It was decided in under two months. I had no compensation and pension exam. And now you're thinking, what? What are you talking about? What? I hate those C&P exams. How did you not get one? Because I uploaded the exact medical evidence the VA rating official needed to make a decision. So they didn't need a C&P exam, okay? Is this making sense to you guys? <sighs> your, your brains are blowing up right now going, how did I not know this stuff, 
all right? So let's jump into secret number two, DBQs and medical nexus letters, how to legally and ethically get that 100% rating if it's deserved. This one's easier than you might think. What the heck are DBQs? Disability benefit questionnaires are downloadable medical forms created for veterans to use in the evaluation process for disability benefits. DBQs help speed, speed the processing of your claim. It gives you control and it allows the rating official to more accurately and quickly make a decision, okay? All it is, guys, is a standardized form, all right? DBQs were developed to streamline the collection of information to process veterans' claims. It makes it easier for you to win your claim, get a higher rating, and have it done faster. I like all those things, all right? Do you like those things? I hope you do. All right, now how many disabilities are covered by DBQs? Right now there's over 70 of them and the VA's adding more all the time. You can Google uh, VA disability DBQs. You can search by symptom and DBQ name. All right, they're constantly updated online, but you can download them and take them to your own private doctors for completion. All right, now odds are your private doctors aren't gonna help you or they're not gonna know what to do. That's where we come in, guys, we can help. All right, DBQs are extremely important and valuable if you file fully developed claims. Now remember, are we gonna file a standard claim or a fully developed claim? <laughs> we only do fully developed claims, all right? You as the veteran needs to take control of your claim and give the VA the exact information you want them to see to make a decision with your claim, all right? Here's an actual DBQ. Okay, our veteran client got a 100% rating for obstructive sleep apnea with this exact DBQ. All right, now take a look at it. This is the sleep apnea DBQ. It was diagnosed with obstructive ICD code, describes the history. Does he need medication? Does he require the, assist, the assistance of a continuous positive airway pressure machine? Yes. What are the findings and symptoms? All right, oxygen desaturations, daytime hypersomolence, chronic respiratory failure, cold pulmonary, all of those things tie to rating criteria under the law, okay? Again, we have medical doctors who will help get these for you, all right? Now, you, we've talked about the DBQ, now we're gonna talk about a nexus letter. A medical nexus letter is a document prepared by a medical professional that explains how a current disability you're suffering from today was due to your service, okay? Or due to another service-connected disability if you're going after secondary service connection, okay? Now, this is especially crucial for veterans who've been out of the service for more than 12 months. Why? Because your presumptive period for direct service connection is over. By law, after 12 months of leaving the service, it gets infinitely harder for you to prove that your conditions are due to your service, okay? Now, a nexus letter is just like an MFR, Memorandum for Record, which you probably wrote in the military. It lists background information, uh, any important details, as well as the, uh, the uh, medical provider's nexus opinion, stating the likelihood that they believe something was due to your service, okay? So the four crucial elements of a nexus letter, a nexus letter should be as brief as possible. All right, I've seen some letters that are 50, 60, 100 pages long. Are you freaking kidding me? You don't need that much, less is more, okay? You just need to have these four elements. Number one, explain how the doctor knows you or how they reviewed the evidence. Then the author, whoever the doctor is, needs to give the rationale as to the opinion, aka it is well known in medical research that, Obstructive sleep apnea can be due to post-traumatic stress disorder. It is my professional opinion. It's at least as likely as not, okay? So they have to list a degree of likelihood, which I'll show you on the next slide. And then they sign and date and put their credentials. That's it, guys. It can be that simple, short and sweet, all right? Now, the statements of likelihood, these are medical nexus opinion statements of likelihood. There's three of them are good, two of them suck. Okay, is due to means the provider is 100% sure. More likely than not means that there's a greater than 50% chance. At least as likely as not, that's the minimum standard, but it's a very good one. Equal to or greater than 50%. Okay, guys, it's just like baseball. Tie goes to the runner. The medical provider basically states, in my opinion, it's at least as likely as not that the veteran's uh, lower back problem is due to their service-connected knee, 
okay? That's enough to grant you service connection by law, okay? But you need a medical nexus letter to do it, especially if you've already been previously denied service connection, all right? Here's an actual nexus letter. Our veteran got a 50% rating for OSA. It's one page long, guys. The doctor explains who they are, explains that this uh, veteran's been under his care, diagnosed with OSA, he's got a CPAP, personally reviewed the medical record, had sleep, hist uh, sleep problems in the military. Uh, he's familiar with the history. The veteran has no known risk factors. In my medical opinion, the sleep apnea is more likely than not due to the service and is the cause of his OSA. The doctor signs and dates his name. That's it. It's that simple, you guys. Don't overthink it. All right. Secret hack number one from a VA raider. This is from an RVSR, okay? An actual raider. So a veteran service rep who's a rating official, an RVSR, with 10 plus years of experience rating disability claims. You want to know what she told me? She said, Brian, tell your tribe, tell your veterans this. DBQs and medical nexus opinions from private providers are extremely helpful for us as raiders when you're trying to determine service connection and current symptoms. You provide an incredible, much needed service for veterans. Thank you. Okay, guys, we can help you get DBQs and medical nexus opinions from our network of private providers. Okay. All right, let's finish up here with secret three keywording modeling, how to structure your statements your personal statements in the exact way that VA raters want to see them so you can win your claim and get a higher rating. All right. I love Tony Robbins. And he says this, if you want to achieve success, all you need to do is find a way to model those who have already succeeded. I love that guys. Why recreate the wheel when you don't have to? All right. Crucial documents. You need a VA form 214138, a statement in support of a claim for every single disability you're claiming. Okay, you also need what are called buddy letters. It's just a credible statement from a firsthand witness on that same form if lay evidence is necessary. Lay evidence just means after the fact evidence. Buddy letters, guys, are extremely important, especially in the absence of any medical documentation from your time in service. Okay, I also recommend something called a sworn declaration. If you've been previously denied service connection, I've got a great template for you guys that I'm gonna give you for free, okay? Another secret hack, I created the world's only online fillable signable buddy letter template, okay? It actually explains to a buddy you were gonna to have to help support your claim exactly what they need to put and where. And guess what? I'm gonna give that to you for free, okay? All right, so who wants to see a real example of a statement, a buddy letter, and a sworn declaration? All right, this is an actual statement, okay, that our veteran got a 100% rating for PTSD. Now take a look at how this is structured. Again, in that first part in red, post-traumatic stress disorder caused by deployment. Okay, so he specifies the condition, what it's due to, then he starts explaining what happened during the deployment, current symptoms, how bad it is, okay, the level of occupational and social impairment, suicidal ideation, boom, done, okay? Be thinking about this, guys, in your personal statements is how do you get very vulnerable and tell the VA Raider your true story, okay? Here's a buddy letter, same exact structure. The veteran just lists, or excuse me, the, uh, the buddy just lists who they are, how they know the veteran, okay, what they witnessed in regards to the PTSD, Anything that uh, he or she saw at work, trouble, um, trouble, things that were going on in your life, and then sign and date your name, okay? Again, that's it. A buddy letter is structured just like your own personal statement, and it can even be on the same form, guys. Okay, remember I talked about a sworn declaration? Here's an example of a sworn declaration. Now, the difference between a sworn declaration and a statement in support of a claim is the sworn declaration has more legal teeth, okay, because you're declaring under penalty of perjury, okay? So if you've ever been denied service connection before, I recommend up in your game if you're comfortable and declaring under penalty of perjury, okay? There's more legal teeth to the VA. All right, so here's secret hack number two from a VA Raider. This is, again, from an RVSR with 15 plus years of experience rating VA disability claims. Brian, please tell your veterans that less is more. Too much stuff slows down the raiders and delays the claim. Make it easy for us. We're trying to help you. 
Describe the disability clearly in your own personal statement. Show the medical diagnosis and how it is related to service or another disability. Tell us in plain English. Guys, stop uploading everything in the kitchen sink in support of your VA claim, okay? More is not more. More might hurt you, okay? So be thinking about, do you have the exact medical evidence you need to win your claim and service connect and get rated at the appropriate level. Don't just keep piling garbage on top of it just because you think they need more information. They don't. VA raters are real people just like you and me. Many of them are veterans. They're trying to help you guys. So just tell them exactly what you want them to know. All right, so who feels like this? <laughs> Anybody feel like this girl? I found this picture online. I was like, yep, that perfectly describes it. We covered a lot of information today, okay? A ton of information. So I know you probably feel like that, okay? But can I have your permission to share with you how to get the rating and compensation you deserve? All right, thank you guys. I always ask for your permission, all right? So if you want a higher VA rating, I'm gonna share with you everything that got me 100% service-connected rating, over 3,300 a month tax-free for life. That's over $2 million, okay? Plus over $5,000 a year for scholarships, plus no property taxes ever again. And all of this happened, by the way, I made that difficult leap from 90 to 100% in less than five months. All of those secret hacks form the foundation and the backbone of VA Claims Insider, okay? So if you're sitting there hearing my voice right now, and you are one of those eight out of 10 who's underrated, you're stuck and you're frustrated, I'm gonna ask you a question. Are you finally ready to get the VA disability rating and compensation you deserve, okay? That's what we do, guys. At VA Claims Insider, we've got a team, a full team of VA claim experts, fellow disabled veterans trained in my process, plus a full medical staff ready and available to help you with the medical evidence you need to win and service connect your VA disability claims. And the best part, you don't owe us anything. It does not cost you a penny unless we get you an increase in your current VA disability rating. Literally, it's 100% risk-free to you. We've accepted all the risk as fellow veterans, okay? Now, we only get paid if and only if we get you an increase, okay? And the best part of it is it's paid with money you don't currently have. The only time you owe us money is if and only if we get you an increase, okay? Win your claim, get you an increase, and let me show you an example, okay? So if you're sitting there hearing my voice, you're like, okay, yes, I'm interested, but is this really free? It is absolutely free to start. Again, you only owe us if we get you an increase. So here's an example. Let's say that you're at 50% now, and you currently get $1,000 a month. All right, and we help, you come into our program uh, and we help you with the medical evidence, you get to 90% overall and you start getting 2,000 a month tax-free for life. Okay, so the total load is the difference times six payable one time at the end. Okay, so 2,000 minus 1,000, 1,000 times six. Now you might be thinking, wait a second, I don't wanna have to pay all that money, I don't have that kind of money laying around. That's okay. The money you would owe us at the end is with money you don't currently have, okay? We have a 12-month no interest payment plan. So you could select $500 a month for 12 months in this example. So if you're thinking about it, think about this for a second. Let's say in this example, this is you. You're currently getting 1,000 a month and we take you to 90%, you're getting 2,000 a month. Even while you're paying us the 500 a month for 12 months, you're still cash flowing an extra 500 a month, even while you're paying us our fee. You literally can't lose, guys. We've structured this deal as fellow veterans to make it a no-brainer because we want to move you forward, okay? So here it is, guys. This is me welcoming you into VA Claims Insider Elite, which is our premier medical consulting program, okay? We've helped over 3,000 veterans in the program directly since 2016. We have a 91% success rate. That means 91 out of 100 veterans who work with us get some kind of an increase in their rating. And right now we have a 30% average rating increase, All right? That means if you were at 30, you ended up at 60. If you were at 60, you ended up at 90, okay? We have a ton of vets who go from 80 to 100, who go from 90 to 100. 
okay? So this is me welcoming you as a fellow disabled veteran into our premier program, okay? And when you join us today, you can say goodbye to your low ball rating, okay? Remember in the beginning, eight out of 10 of you are underrated. That makes me angry. That means that you are missing out on VA disability benefits that you deserve, okay? You can get rid of your VSO if you want to. A person who never calls you back, who doesn't help you. But if you want to keep him or her, you certainly can, okay? You can say goodbye to the doctors who won't help you with DBQs and Nexus opinions because we have them, they will do them for you, okay? And you can say goodbye to the stress and frustration of feeling alone. All right, so what are you going to get today when you join Elite? You're going to get assigned a personal veteran claims expert, a VCE, who's assigned to you. You're going to get access to our network of trained and certified medical professionals for DBQs and medical nexus opinions, plus tons of real templates so you can literally copy and paste. Okay, we have copy and paste personal example templates, um, statements in support of a claim, buddy letters, sworn declarations. We know what works, guys. Stop struggling on your own. Okay, that's a $1,997 value. Okay, but that's not it. You're also going to get access to the VA Claims Insider Mastermind. Okay, a mastermind is the concept that iron sharpens iron. Okay, now here's what you're going to get, 24-7, 365 live support and Q&A from me, my team of over 35 fellow disabled veterans and medical professionals, and over 2,000 fellow disabled veterans just like you, all right? We do live video coaching calls once a month. I do hold special training sessions. I answer your questions. I go live inside the group, okay? This is high value stuff, all right? This isn't just worthless information that you get out on all these spam Facebook groups. Good Lord, there's some Facebook groups out there that are absolutely awful. Tons of people sharing wrong information, guys. Okay, you're also gonna get instant access to all my cheat sheets, quick hit videos and templates, all right? Here's the mastermind. This is the Facebook group. Now take a look at this, over 4,300 people are trying to join, but they can't get in because they're not members. Okay, but look at on the right hand side, there's over 1700 of you in the mastermind. Chances are somebody has already overcome and figured out the exact thing you're struggling with right now. How to get something connected. Hey, <coughs> is this possibly a presumptive condition? Brian, how do I service connect this? Hey, do you think I have, <coughs> excuse me, a potential claim for chronic pain? Stop struggling on your own. Okay, now here's the stack today. All right, you're gonna get into VA Claims Insider Elite. Your personal VCE assigned to you, our network of trained and certified medical professionals, tons of real templates. You're gonna get immediate access to the mastermind group. Okay, live 24 7, 365 QA, a $564 value. Total value today of 2,561. Okay, now check out some of these actual results from real clients, okay? 3,000 plus fellow veterans can't be wrong, guys. Please don't continue to struggle on your own, okay? Are you ready to get your results, all right? If so, now is the time, okay? I'm also gonna be sharing with you how you get $5,000 per year extra. Direct award academic scholarships, guys, for your spouse and dependents, how to file for it, how you get paid every single year, I'm going to give you my masterclass video with on-screen teaching. You're also going to get my essay strategies handbook. Okay, so now look at what we're at. You're going to get access to Elite. You're going to get assigned a veteran claims expert, a fellow disabled veteran who's trained and certified in Brian Reese's process, the VA Claims Insider. That person's going to be assigned to you in your case. Okay, you're going to get access to our network of trained and certified medical professionals. So you can get DBQs and medical nexus opinions, tons of real templates, you can copy and paste. You're going to get access to the mastermind group, okay, a $564 value per year. And you're also going to get everything I know of how you get $5,000 a year in direct academic scholarships. Total value today, guys, this is what it's worth, $7,561, all right? Take a look at our reviews, by the way. 101 plus reviews growing every single day on Google. All right, we're the only five-star rated company out there, period. 
We are at five star reviews, guys. All right. We're also a Better Business Bureau accredited business. All right. Look at Rick St. Jean. It's never too late to make a claim. I was 20% from 97 to 2016 in a matter of 14 months. I'm now 100% P&T. The elite group has great psychologists using their DBQ. I was able to get an increase without an exam. Any questions, ask Brian Reese. He's got the knowledge and the willingness to help. Okay. Now take a look at this. This is from a real elite client. Wow. How awesome is that? All right. Super cool from Brian Telos. And again, one of the cool things is when you guys join our elite program today, we're going to become personal friends. You're going to get to know me. You're going to get insider access into all of the stuff we're teaching. Okay. Now you can join today via Claims Insider Elite for free. Are you kidding me, Brian? No, no, I'm not kidding. All right. And you're also going to get $7,561 worth of extra value to help you win your VA claim and get a higher rating, even if you've already filed or been denied, okay? So you can join today, today only for all of these added bonuses, by the way, okay? And yes, I can see where you're coming from and if you join today, okay? You can experience VA Claims Insider Elite in this life-changing experience for yourself today only for free. Okay, there's the free sign up link right there, guys. Go to vaclaimsinsiderelite.com. Now, if you want all the free bonuses, when you go to that page and you go to sign up, there's a spot that says, Did somebody refer you here? Put that you watched uh, the Facebook video training. Okay, and that way I'll know where you came from and that uh, to unlock the bonuses for you. Okay, so again, guys, you can join today for free, you don't owe us anything. The only time you owe us anything is if and only if we get you an increase, okay? And that's only with money you don't currently have. So it never costs you anything out of pocket, guys. It's a no-brainer, okay? Now, you can see here the free sign-up link on the screen, vaclaimsinsiderelite.com. Uh, depending on if you're watching from a mobile device or a desktop or laptop computer, there should also be a box that has popped in now um, on the webinar event here. So you can just click that box that says sign up here now. Um, and that will also take you to VA Claims Insider Elite. Okay. Now, why don't you think about this? If you only, let's say that you only signed up today for the bonuses. Let's say you're like, I'm signing up, Ryan, but I'm just sort of like dipping a toe in. I'm not really all that all in. You're going to get a seven times return on your investment in your time today because you're joining for free and you're still going to get the bonuses. 
okay? So think about this. The only time you owe us a penny is if and only if we get you an increase, all right? If, let's say you come into our program, you're at 20%, we work your claim, you do an independent psych eval, you get a DBQ for OSA, you get a DBQ and a nexus letter for your back connected to your hip. Now, let's say the VA denies you, okay? You owe us nothing because we didn't win your claim and we didn't get you an increase, okay? We're expert medical consultants. Now, if we do win your claim and get you an increase, it's six times the monthly increase payable one time to us with money you don't currently have. And if you select our no interest payment plan, it never impacts your cash flow. In fact, even while you're paying us our monthly fee for 12 months, you're still earning more than you are right now. Guys, it's a no brainer decision. Hey, there's the free sign up link again. VA claims insider elite.com. Okay, you can sign up for free today. Remember to put in that referral section in the, in the, uh, the registration process on page one. Put there that uh, you watch the Facebook video training. Okay. Now you got two choices, guys. Choice number one is you don't join. You're still afraid. You're still stuck. You're still frustrated. You don't get results. You don't get the rating and compensation you deserve. Brownie face. Okay. Or choice number two, you can join today for free, access the expert help and support you need, and finally get the VA disability rating and compensation you deserve after all these years, regardless of how stuck and frustrated you are right now. Okay. That's the happy face. <laughs> okay. So again, sign up for free. Who's with me, guys? I see people starting to sign up. This is friggin' awesome. Okay. Free sign up link. Go to VAClaimsInsiderElite.com, guys. It's a three-step intake process. Part one is you just fill out some basic information. Part two is you have to sign our medical consulting service agreement and privacy policy. Okay, everything we're talking about today is governed by HIPAA, which are medical laws and the sharing of medical information. We and our medical team cannot view your medical information unless you give us approval to do so. Okay, so we have an agreement in place to protect you, to protect us, to protect our medical providers, okay? And then once you sign the agreement and privacy policy, you'll have a link pop up that says join the mastermind on Facebook because you get the bonus today, and boom, you're in. We're off to the races, guys, all right? Go to vaclaimsinsiderelite.com, all right? Look at Mark Bartholomew. Got one of my claims today, 100%. I'm weeping in gratitude to Devin, Richard, Brian. You guys helped me after 43 years and lost records. I'm speechless. Thank you, Jesus. Okay, he posted this. Mark did inside the mastermind on Facebook. Look at Pedro. August 11th to November 27th, the help of Brian Reese, PA, Pat O'Neill for the Nexus, Reina and staff at VA Claims Insider Mastermind, 70% to 100%. These are real results, guys, that we are getting for veterans every single day. All right, now what is information worth? Information alone is worth nothing. You can spend countless hours online endlessly searching amateur opinions, and you'll still be stuck and frustrated because you won't know how to do it. You've got no game plan. There's no strategy. There's no tactics behind the strategy, okay? Now, you can stop wasting your time endlessly searching online and being in these amateur Facebook groups where nobody knows what they're talking about. Or you can spend 10 to 15 hours with me, the VA Claims Insider team inside of our elite program. You can get the exact expert specialized knowledge you need. You can use our medical team who will actually help you with DBQs and Nexus opinions. You can take action and finally get the rating and compensation you deserve in about half the time. Okay. Our typical process from start to finish takes us about 30 days. So from the date you become our client today, 30 days from now, we'll have your claim ready for you to submit. Okay. And then it's about 90 to 120 days after that for you to get your new, uh, your new rating. Okay. It's a pretty fast process guys. All right. What are you waiting for? All right. There's the link again. It's free to sign up today. VA claims insider elite.com. All right, now you might be going, okay, Brian, yeah, but will it work for me? Okay, well, I, th I think it will if you fall in one of these categories. You're a current service member 
or a current service member about to separate or retire, or you're already a veteran and you've either submitted a claim already, you got denied or you didn't get the result, AKA you, you believe that you're underrated right now, okay? Or maybe you wanna file for increases. So maybe you're at 10% or 30% or 90%, but you believe you're underrated and you wanna file for some increases. The only way those increases are going to get approved, guys, is with new medical evidence to show that your symptoms are worse. That's what we help you do, okay? So stop struggling. Stop being frustrated on your own. You can sign up for free right now at vaclaimsinsiderelite.com. All right, so here's the total stack again. One more time. What are you going to get? Again, I got one more bonus for you guys, so don't leave yet. What do you get inside of VA Claims Insider Elite? You get a VCE who's going to help you all the way through the network of trained and certified professionals, DBQs and Nexus, tons of real templates. That's a $1,997 value. You're going to get immediate one year of access to my live 24-7, 365 mastermind group on Facebook. That's a $564 value. And then you're also going to learn how to get $5,000 per year in direct award academic scholarships for your spouse and dependents. So if you've got any kiddos in college or private schools, all right, this is going to help you. Total value today of $7,561. And you can join Elite today for free, all right, for free. Look at Lee. I went from 10 to 60%. From 10.8 to 12.1, all right? That's less than 60 days, guys, 10 to 60%. He had waited for years on previous claims just to get denied. Mark Hawley, 20 to 50 in less than six months, okay? After being in law enforcement, stuck for 15 years. Guys, stop struggling on your own. We can help you. Veterans helping veterans. That's who we are. That's what we do. That's why we exist, okay? We believe veterans are stuck frustrated and underrated. We believe the VA keeps screwing you over. Okay. Our purpose, our calling is to help all veterans get what they legally, morally, and ethically and medically deserve. We are insiders. That's our calling guys. That's our credo that we believe. All right. There's a free three-step intake. VA claims insider elite. Dot com. Remember to put there in the referral source that you watched the, uh, the Facebook video, okay? And then I'll make sure to unlock the bonuses today, okay? Again, guys, it's a free three-step intake. Brian Case, 100% PMT for PTSD. It would not have happened without Brian Reese. Much anxiety on my part, but calmness and reassurance on Brian's part, always asking the right questions and pointing me in the right direction. Jason, 100% rating from the VA first shot. Ed Cunningham, 100% from 90%. Jermaine, 80% first shot after struggling on my own for years. Guys, this is the answer to your problem. VA Claims Insider Elite, our premier medical consulting program, the most highly rated program in the universe, run by fellow disabled veterans for you as veterans. All right, this is your answer to getting you the VA rating and compensation you deserve. Okay, go to vaclaimsinsiderelite.com. All right, remember I mentioned a free bonus. So thank you guys for listening. Appreciate your time and attention today. I'm gonna give you my 10-page ebook, The Nine Secret Strategies for Winning Your VA Disability Claim. It's a 10-page ebook. It is the number one rated and most downloaded free VA Claims ebook, okay? Over 250,000 veterans just like you have downloaded it since 2016. All right, so how do you get it? Get out your mobile device, all right? I know you probably have one. In fact, you might even be on it right now, okay? All you need to do is open up your text message feature, okay? And in the number of, let's say you're picking a number of who you're gonna send a message to, the number is 678 506 seven five four three okay that's the number that you're sending the message to and then the text message should be insider one in all caps okay so again text to the number six seven eight five zero six 
7543. And the message should be in all caps, INSIDER1. Okay. Now, once you send that message, you're going to get a reply back from me that says, Hey, it's Brian. Uh, reply to this message with your email address. Okay. So once you get that reply, type the best email address for you. Don't worry, I'm not going to spam you. All right. Put your email address in there, and bam, in about five minutes, your high value digital download the nine secret strategies for winning your VA disability claim will arrive in your inbox. It's that simple, guys. My free gift to you for sticking around today. Um, I really appreciate you guys, man. I mean, I, I'm telling you, um, this is what we do. When I wake up in the morning, I think about you guys. I think about how I can help you guys get the rating and compensation you deserve. And I'll tell you, nothing makes me more proud is when a veteran wins their claim. We just had a, a Vietnam veteran uh, yesterday, had no rating, had been struggling on his own for 40 years, severe Parkinson's due to Agent Orange exposure. Uh, one of our medical providers helped him get that service connected. He got 100% P&T. Uh, I was in tears yesterday. I really was uh, on the phone with him, um, hearing him tell his story and I think what was the most amazing to me was the thing that he was most worried about is making sure that this benefit could transfer to his spouse uh, when he passes and stuff like that, guys, like it just, even now, like it gives me chills when I hear these stories of how we're changing veterans lives every single day. Um, and I just, I couldn't be more proud of our team, our medical professionals. And, um, and I want to help you guys, right? I want to help you get your, new rating and compensation. Okay. All right, guys, as always, thank you for your service. God bless you and your families. Thank you for your sacrifice to our country. Thank you for raising your hand and taking that oath. Um, we are part of an elite special group, guys, v disabled veterans in the United States. We have to help each other. We have to support each other. Um, if I can be of any assistance to you at all, please reach out through our website at vaclaimsinsider.com. And uh, until then, we'll chat again very soon. All right, guys, love you.